The Nighthawk app makes it easy to set up your router and get more out of your Wi-Fi. First, you'll need to download the app from the Apple App Store or Google Play Store. Once connected to your router's local Wi-Fi network, open the app. Log in or create your Netgear account if you haven't already. This account gives you access to the latest router features like remote management, Alexa, and Google Assistant voice commands, and more that require cloud access. Keep in mind that this account is different from your router's admin credentials, which are used to securely change and update your router settings. From the app dashboard, you'll see a list of features that your router supports. Device list will let you monitor the devices connected to your network. You can easily pause the internet by clicking on the pause resume toggle switch next to the device. To get more information on the device, like which Wi-Fi band it is connected to or IP address, simply tap on the info icon. You can also use the internet speed feature in the app to test the internet speed from your service provider to your router. Simply click on test speed and start the test. This may take a minute to finish. You can also change your Wi-Fi network names and passwords by clicking on the Wi-Fi settings tile and the network you'd like to update. Keep in mind, you'll need to reconnect your devices to the new network if you change the Wi-Fi settings. The guest network feature is especially useful for when you have guests over and you'd like to give them Wi-Fi access. Setting up a guest network lets you keep your primary network password private and keeps guests from accessing any of your personal connected devices. Select the guest network you'd like to create, set up the Wi-Fi credentials, and click Save. If your router supports Circle with Disney Smart Parental Controls, simply click on the tile and toggle to enable the feature. Circle with Disney allows you to filter online content and limit online time for devices. From the main dashboard, you can view your router's details by clicking on the router image. Here, you'll see your router's model, current firmware version, and more. You can manually check for firmware updates by clicking Check for Updates. Remote management is also a great feature, allowing you to access and control your network from virtually anywhere with internet access. You can pause Wi-Fi for connected devices or even enable a guest network remotely. To set up remote management if you haven't already, click on the icon in the top left corner, select Settings, Remote Management, and Enable. You will now be able to see a list of routers associated to your Netgear account that you can connect to from anywhere with internet access. Remote management on your router also allows you to set up voice commands using your Google Assistant or Amazon Alexa device. Once enabled, simply link the voice device to your router using the Amazon Alexa or Google Assistant app. Stay tuned for more great features and visit netgear.com support for the latest information on your router. Thanks for watching. This video is suitable for AC1900 wireless dual band gigabit routers, Archer C9 and other cable routers. Turn off your modem. Connect the internet port on your router to the modem's LAN port with an ethernet cable. Turn on the modem and wait 2 minutes. Connect your router to a power supply and press the power button. If the 2.4 GHz and 5 GHz LEDs are off, please press the Wi-Fi button on the side panel for about 2 seconds. The internet light will come on when you finish the configuration. Click the default 2.5 or 5 GHz wireless network icon. The wireless network name is printed on the product label on the rear panel. If neither of these networks appear, click the refresh button. When prompted, enter the network security key. 
This is printed on the product label on the rear panel as well. Then you can configure the router with a web browser. If you cannot connect the router to your computer wirelessly, you can connect via a cable. Simply connect the router to your desktop or laptop via an Ethernet cable. Make sure your computer is not connected to any other wireless network. Once you are connected to the wireless router, open a web browser and type in tp-link wifi.net into the address field. The username is admin, the password is admin. Then press login. Once you have successfully logged in, click quick setup. Select your region and time zone, then click next to follow the quick setup guide. If your router has already got an internet connection, skip to the wireless setting up. If you do not have an internet connection, please choose from the following connection types. If you are unsure, please select Auto Detect and click Next. Please find the username and password from your internet service provider. Verify or change the wireless dual band network setting and click Next. Confirm your settings and then click save to continue or back to change them. To complete the configuration, press finish and you're connected to the internet. If after watching this video you are still experiencing problems setting up your wireless dual band router, please email support.uk at tp-link.com and include your name and daytime phone number so we can contact you. Hi guys, I'm here today to talk to you about TP-Link's first 802.11 AC wireless router, the Archer C7. The Archer C7 comes with the next generation Wi-Fi standard, 802.11 AC, three times faster than wireless end speeds. Total data transfer speeds can achieve up to 1.75 gigabits per second with 1.3 gigabits per second over the clear 5 gigahertz channel and 450 megabits per second over the 2.4 gigahertz channel. With gigabit wireless speeds, the Archer C7 allows all of your home's devices such as tablets, laptops, gaming consoles and TVs to have more reliable connections at faster speeds than ever. This 11AC router is also backward compatible with 11BGN devices. So not only do you get the fastest wireless speeds ever, but you also future-proof your network. Featuring six total antennas, three external and three internal, you can enjoy incredible wireless coverage and reliability from anywhere in your home or office with the C7. The Archer C7 also comes with two USB ports that allow you to share printers, movies, or music in your home network or even across the internet. It's not only a powerful router, but also super easy to set up with TP-Link Tether. Using TP-Link Tether, you can easily configure your router at just a few touches on your phone, view a live network map, and manage connected devices, stream router connected files and media to your devices, set parental control rules, and more. The Archer C7 also includes a guest network feature that provides secure Wi-Fi access for guests sharing your home or office network. Go with TP-Link's Archer C7 and embrace the next generation of Wi-Fi. Welcome to Linksys Smart Wi-Fi, the easy way to control your home Wi-Fi anywhere. Now, there's more to enjoy with an all-new app that's easier to use than ever. Having people over? Give them access to your home Wi-Fi with a text. Create a safe internet experience so you and your kids can enjoy their online time. Block sites. Turn on or off a homework schedule, or just pause the internet when it's time for dinner. 
see who's online. Tap here to see which devices are using your Wi-Fi. Or prioritize devices, like your TV for movie night. Get started today.